So in this video, we're going to learn how to put a repository, a GitHub repository down onto your Pi. Um, so here I'm in my GitHub account and I'm going to create a new repository, particularly for um, this class. So I click on the little plus sign over here, go new repository. And the repository name, I'm going to say 10 digital solutions space class work. Radio. Um, it's going to be public or private, doesn't really matter. Description, I'm just going to say in here, um, this is the uh, class work um, files for 10 digital solutions. All right, public's fine with me. I'm going to add a readme file. Um, so I've got that. So once I've done all that, I'm going to go create repository. You have to do that once and it's created my repository and now I now need to actually get the um, the details that I'm going to send into my github so I need to go into code here and now I want to click and I want to copy this URL so they click on the keyboard there uh, I have copied that URL so now I come back to my github so I'm going to back to my Pi, and in the Pi, I need to um, create, a, go into my terminal here, and I need to create a repository, radio, um, I need to clone the repository. So how I do that is I actually will, uh, so um, I'm here, I need to type git, to this git the software, um, that actually will communicate with GitHub. Git, and then I'm going to type clone, which is going to take a copy of the URL. I'm going to paste the URL, and if I go Control V, I don't get what I want. So I need actually a right mouse click and say paste. And now put the repository there that I have actually copied the URL. You can see of it here. So if I press Enter, that is now cloning it and putting it onto my Pi. So if I now open up the terminal, um, open up the files here, you will see that in my Pi home folder here, so in my Pi folder, it's got 10 DS classwork. So you can see that's the repository we just did there. Um, yep, so that's the information that's in there. So now I'm gonna show you how to do that in the terminal. You don't actually necessarily have to see it within the GUI interface, the file structure. So here I can just go CD to change directory because I'm currently in this Pi folder and I want to get into this folder here. So CD 10 DS hyphen classwork. And you'll see here I'm now actually in that folder. And if I go LS, which is going to list the stuff that's in that folder, you'll see the readme. So if I open that folder up, you'll see there's the readme there. So I've actually got there. Now I'm in here, I need to pull all the latest information down from um, the repository. So whenever I want to get the information down the repository, I come into the actual file, into the, rep, um, the file here, into the folder, and I say git pull, and it'll take anything from GitHub that isn't up to date and it will pull it down and put it onto my computer so I'll get the latest files um, from the GitHub repository. So that's how you set a repository up in um, your Pi, a GitHub repository up on your Pi.